Pancho Panchito, tú eres mi amorcito, ay Pancho Panchito, tú eres mi amorcito, ay Pancho, ay Pancho. Warning, the following videos aren't intended to her and or bully anyone. It's solely my job in salvation to report on what's going on with the YouTube community and give my opinion because my opinion matters. Sorry about that. We need her junior discretion is advised. Yo, what is going on, guys? It is your boy Francisco back at it again with another banger of a video. If you're new to this channel and you end up subscribing, welcome aboard to the Panchita Familia. First and foremost, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Today is Monday. You know what I'm saying? I had to start a correct with cheese, man. Make sure to smack this like button and show me you guys enjoy these videos on YouTube. We're on a roll. Yeah, feel me. I told y'all gonna try to push out 15 videos out for y'all this month but aside from that subscribe to the channel if you haven't already let's go ahead and get started with this week's freak of the week and it goes to babe wake up poncho uploaded a new video now the first thing that we're gonna be talking about did you guys see what let's do makeup yeah feel me now we've always talked about this how allegedly you know alex doesn't really love her like that as much as les loves him yada 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 these are all speculations but there are some tiktok videos going around you know what i'm saying one of a, a recent podcast that he did he was kind of you know explaining the whole situation how they met but the way he said it uh, caught all the comments attention they were saying like why do you have to say it like that yeah feel me so allegedly they were on a talking stage for about two years until he finally uh, even asked her out to be the girlfriend and this happened my people are saying that les to make up loves her fiance alex more than he loves her after this video got a lot of attention we met through twitter social media and she came across one of my tweets i remember she followed me but uh she never like messaged me or nothing i just you know you stalk the media you know you stalk her page and say, yeah ah, whatever she's cute but i never really used to message her and she would have messaged me either until like she's the one who actually said in my dm yeah i used to work out of town all week so yeah we would text here and there during the week. It was nothing too crazy. When did you like make it official? Not till like 2017, bro. Two years? Yeah. So for two years, you were just kicking it. We were just kicking it, bro. I was like, yo, not that we have to move in together, but I need to get my own pad. Or yeah. I was like, you don't have to live with me. I was like, I'm not here all week anyways. I was like, you ain't got to stay here. I was like, we just, that'll be our pad for the weekend and shit, like when, when I come home. Yeah. And we kind of agreed on that. And I got to the apartment and the goal was not to live together. Mm -hmm. It was just... You know we're gonna kick it here on the weekend yeah. if you want to come stay here during the week which by yourself, happened come stay it doesn't matter and yeah yeah, yeah definitely mm -hmm. oh i get i lock in the apartment and then I, we went and looked at it i move all my shit in and then she's like i think i want to live here and i'm like dun, are you sure dun, dun. she's like yeah i want to move in i was like well i don't know i was like well, we don't have time to discuss that right now this weekend i was like maybe next weekend we can talk to your parents see what they feel and okay blah blah, blah. so i go back to work it's like during the week She's already buying stuff <laughs> for the apartment. I'm like, okay. I'm like, so are you moving in? She's like, yeah, I'm going to move in. She's like, I want to bring all my stuff this weekend. When oh, my I'm God. Like, Fuck. She always liked him more than he does. This is why he is the way he is. He never really chased her or it seems he didn't even like her. He gives me weird vibes. You can tell right away that Les loves him more. He loves her, but she does more. I'll be like, talk to my friends. Love you, Les. Thank you, girl. You know what? And he's like, you guys are so cute. Emoji heart. <laughs> I'm like, boy, if you don't, I'm just kidding. But you, mm, I'm not married. And he's like, him and his family and everybody's like, you guys are practically married. After aye, aye, your family too. Yeah, my family, his family, everybody is like, you guys are practically married. I was like, I ain't got a ring on this finger, so <laughs> I'm not married. <laughs> and we always like go back and forth about that, but I don't know. TMI. No, not, not TMI. You guys are my friends. I tell them everything. Like, <laughs> TMI. That's a touchy subject. Yeah, but I literally tell them everything <laughs> like what bra they wear type of shit now if you see that other tiktok video you can see there about the whole you know marriage yada 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 how that took forever now obviously they're together they're married yada 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 they're either gonna get married or whatever the case is but alex always gets you know the backlash because people are saying he doesn't really truly love her and i'm saying Ew, ew, ew. they look like they got everything situated a lot of people were upset at the podcast response that alex had what do you guys think about this whole situation with mr Vlex and uh, miss let's do makeup make sure to comment down below and did you guys see with shyla labov she basically was calling out landon for being a, a bad parent yada 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 how he's always posting her on snapchat doesn't get the kid stuff and then the girlfriend of landon actually had a response had something rather than nothing to say and she had this to say Mike. the fact that you would believe something because someone said it with no truth or evidence backing it 
apartment is completely sad. Not only does Soul have one room, she has two. She has a playroom and her own room. It's sickening that someone's able to get on the internet, spread lies, and people like you are gullible enough to believe it. I hope you educate yourself and realize that some people's intentions are not good and are to harm someone else's reputation and well-being. So then the girl responded and said, Sophia, I'm glad you took the time out of your Coachella festival to respond to me. Oh, is it the two same rooms that I post with the twin size mattress on the floor? It's sickening that you can stand behind a narcissist man like that. For what, a fake Birkin? LMAO, what does he show you, Sophia? You're a skate on his Snapchat all day and he uses your cocodrilo all day. You have a degree and you're very pretty and smart. Stand up, like I said. There's been a ton of girls who come out exposing Landon and the real him and the fact that they're attempting to defend his deadbeat behaviors is crazy. Check back in a year. You'll be the next one making a YouTube video. I hope you truly educate yourself on truly what a loving relationship looks like but for now be blinded you deserve better xoxo so then she was big big mad and she said babe a twin side bed on the floor did you see a picture of this did you see this or you're just believing what you heard you realize this is a lie a lie how to support someone who lies on someone's name to ruin their life because they are mad how do you not see this a social media and the show is just for online attitude this isn't real life you see what you want to see who exposes Landon, his ex recently who continued to talk to him and beg for him back maya please girl realize what you're saying fake bird girl so you want to talk to a guy who sold it that i've known personally for years Zabang. now i said sheesh louise i didn't think that the girlfriend would get involved but she basically called out shyla and said stop lying mentirosa she actually has two rooms now i was actually told when i went on Insta, uh, when i went on tiktok live i was told uh, by you guys that he actually did like a video or something like that that he actually showed on snapchat so to miss shyla she allegedly was lying when she said that because he did like a room tour or stuff as much as you know people don't like landing we got to put the fact for the facts her at he does have two rooms a playroom and then the one for, for her to sleep or whatever so make sure to comment down below I'm not sure why she always takes it to social media uh, to kind of go after Landon McBroom. It appears that Landon's kind of doing his own thing alongside with Austin McBroom. But make sure to comment down below what you guys think about the whole situation. And did you guys see for the world news in Colombia, they're asking people to shower together to reserve the water because they're low on supply on water. My God. Now, allegedly, this is due to El Nino is what it's called, the weather El Nino. Uh, I didn't even know that, you know, Colombia, especially I think in Bogota, that they're, you know, the water reserves are kind of low. I didn't really know this, but allegedly they said, y'all better shower together, big dogs. Now, I'm going to go ahead and wrap up the video here for you guys. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Remember, take a second, pause the video and subscribe. It shows me you guys appreciate these type of videos on YouTube. So I want to abandon y'all and I really do appreciate you guys.